Yes, I know it feels unnatural to say anything to someone who has had a, a loved one or a family member die. It feels like maybe uh, because our instinct is to want to make everything better. It feels like nothing I can say can make this better. But um, as someone who uh, had a best friend, uh, my best friend died about 10 years ago, um, I could sense when people felt that way. Um, but I still appreciated uh, that they said something. I think that's the point. I think we're here to connect as human beings and um, we're supposed to care for each other as best we can. Not the people that we hate but uh, that, or have ideological differences with, but everyone else. And we care for who we care for. And um, for me, all behavior is behavioral therapy. So I just keep faking it till I make it. Uh, I keep trying to be real. And then hopefully, eventually, I'm uh, real. It happens sometimes. I don't have a lot of time to talk. I was very happy to Steve, see uh, Steve A.G. in front of my house the other day. It made me feel like I live in a small town. And somebody drives by and says, hey! And usually when somebody yells at me on the street, I do not even acknowledge it. It never ends well, usually. But this time it ended really great. And um, Lynn, I'm glad you're better. Jill, your smoking worries me a little bit. I say this as an ex-smoker. Um, the way you smoke, though, is almost like you're not inhaling. It's like, uh, it's very, <laughs> it's like the way I smoked when I was young, I guess. Then I got old, and I was like, oh, sucked it in. And of course, you don't smoke anymore. Uh, I'm going out to dinner. I had my, my kid's birthday party today, which was a very low-key affair. We only had a taco cart and uh, some puppies come over to play with the kids. It was actually kind of like the, the way you would uh, have a... Um, I can't say anything. I was going to say special needs, but I better not just say anything at all. It was like uh, occupational therapy for little kids. The mouth's low key for LA, in my backyard. Very calm. And um, I gotta go. I can hear my husband using his Sonicare. He's gonna walk out here. But I think I'm gonna have dinner with Martha tonight. That's exciting. All right. Am I missing anybody else? Michael Ian Black, fake it till you make it. Pretend that you care and you will start to care. I think that's my motto. Hmm. Hmm.